Okay, I had to adjust my microphone. Um, I'm, I don't like that it does this now. Maybe I should just play like this, and then jump down and begin my episodes again, because I always liked starting them in the plaza, more say, and uh, I'm pretty sure you guys probably would have liked it more, hopefully. But um, anyways, hey guys, it's me, Tuck, and I have to kind of be quiet, because um, I had a, a lot of stuff planned today, and I'm just now getting around to the time of recording, and I wanted to today. But the... Um, the time is like going on to almost 3 a.m. and I am still somewhat awake. So I was like, why not, you know, get this recording going? Because I wanted to. And uh, oh man, I don't know if I want to play Olimar or Pikmin. By the way, I have crackers, but I don't know if eating them would be a good idea. But uh, you know, I'm just gonna eat one right now, anyways. I'll play um Pikmin. Yeah. Okay. So, we got to here last time, and we literally almost got molested by the friggin' Beeb. Bladed Beeb, whatever, or in that case, like, Wrecking Ball Death Machine Beeb. But, um, we're gonna do this one now. Oh, this one looks fun. Cage of Terror? Uh. So. I was, um pretty much loving the two Pikmin levels that I was doing because they were so good like oh my god it was ridiculous oh this looks fun kind of uh, I don't know we'll see oh Sean's my partner sweet we will take crime and kick names yeah I don't even know where I was going at with that there oh my god this is what I hate I should be the friggin' captain. See, I'm already hit. Are you kidding me? That thing literally pushed me into that. Which is bull. That's right. Eat it. Okay. Oh, and now you're, you're fire type, which is great. Oh my god, we have a water type over here. We've got a badass over here. Oh my god. They're all everywhere. This is ridiculous. Okay. I just want the nectar. I want the M. That's what I want. Dear Lord. Oh my God. It's like, it is what it is. It, it's a fighting cage. I just noticed the name. I'm so stupid. Don't reply back to that. <laughs> Okay, that's not cool, dude. Okay, there are so many over here. I'm just gonna go ahead and beat you up right here, because you're full of crap. Oh, we have a heart, thank god. Okay, his pigmen are gonna get that, which is good. And we're just gonna reap the benefits. <laughs> Pretty much. Thank you, Sean. Oh, dear god. What are you doing? Oh, you're underwater? I mean, underground? Wow. Underwater. I'm smart. Can I kill you for- Oh man, you're underwater now. Dang it. Oh my god. These don't even drop nectar. You know how much that sucks? Okay, you better drop some nectar. A uh, one heart. Okay, wow. Um, what? Ah, Dark Monita, you friggin- Um. I don't like this. Are you kidding me? Dear God, I'm just gonna jump on you. There we go. Oh man, I fell. Is there like a power up on the side? Okay, of course not. Bam, take it, Beeb. Take it, take it, take it. What? Oh, now it's pissed. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Just keep running. Aw oh man, it got me again. I'm gonna die. 
I'm so dead. I should be I should be Olimar for this mission. Oh my god. Oh, I missed with that one. Oh sh Just don't go near Captain Olimar. Sorry, Sean. You're gonna have to fight that alone. Give me a heart, please, you stupid trick. You friggin' You fucked me up. Oh my god! I'm worthless here. This is horrible. I am completely worthless right here. Great, now he's pissed, and now it's gonna be a whole cycle of bullshit. Oh my god, how is he so... Why are they so easy? Why are you so easy right now? Your partner's friggin' easy. Oh my god, I should not be talking. I did not get hit by you, that is bullshit right now. Okay, I'm gonna go for that. Okay, I died. <laughs> well, you guys got to see the escape failure sequence. That's awesome, right? No, it's not at all. <laughs> Dang it, I'm gonna have to play as the gamepad for this one, I'm sorry guys. That literally just raped me. Like, I feel, I feel burnt because I was a plant and um, I guess violated I, I I was literally thinking of a word I, I was paused for a moment I guess it's me and my clone though so maybe we'll get crap done here unfortunately it is live mode though but maybe we can uh, salvage for stuff is there any of course not there never is let's just forget I guess good Okay, at least we didn't die right there, which is good. Um, 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 okay, escape. This just makes me, the more I play Pikmin Adventure, the more I'm excited for Pikmin 3. Okay, let's make them all blue. Perfect. Okay, my Pikmin are dying, this is not cool. Okay, you're not, get away from me. Oh my god, why, okay, so much. This is literally some intense stuff going on right now. And all this nectar's not being picked up, let's make you, you need to die. It's your, it's your turn to die now. Okay. Bam. It's so easy being Captain Olimar, it's just hard being, like, the, the pigment, because you're stuck with that color. Like, you literally are stuck with that color, so... Okay, I need to be red. I'm literally just really focused right now, because I don't want to die again. That literally sucked. And right now, I just want to live. <laughs> okay. Here comes the part with all the friggin' bladed bee bullshits. Good lord. So, um, I guess I could start talking some nonchalant talk, like I always usually do. And pretty much, I'm gonna talk about the fact that I purchased Earthbound, and it is so good. Like, I, actually, I haven't tried it yet, but I, I'm literally, I cannot wait. I literally am so excited. Okay, you need to go, dude. Get him, Pigman. Get him. Get that ass. How is he not dead? Like, that Pigman is literally... My clone is getting it right now. I don't see how, but he is. Imagine this thing, if this thing is in Pigman 3, I'm gonna shit bricks. I'm literally not even kidding. Because I will be one screwed. Oh my god. Okay. You wanna play now? Let's play. I got friggin' knuckle powers. I will punch your face off. That's right. Punch him. Punch him. Just, just go. See? We've already got everything else. Look at this. Bam. My clone better get this power up. They want to be living large. But yes, I did get Earthbound. I have never played it. I didn't watch... I've, Of course, I know there's Let's Plays out there like Trevor Conroy's and all that, and you know that stuff. But I've never really gotten into one, because I just wanted to try it blind. And um, I was actually contemplating if I actually ever wanted to Let's Play it. Excuse me. Oh, Whipseed better. Love Whipseed. Where does this take me? Is this a trap? Let's see what this is. Uh, <laughs> let's go after Big Papa here while the Pikmin man goes after everything else. Okay. There we go. Okay, that's cool. I'm just literally like, 
there's so much stuff going on that it's ridiculous. Okay, what are what are you? Okay, options for stuff. Um, yeah, you get that coin. Okay, so I just really wanted to try Earthbound on my own because I, it's just. I mean, I don't really want to spoil, like, all the games out there from the Let's Play. I mean, I want to save some of them for me. When I do New Super Mario Bros. U, I'm going to be, like, for the most part, except for, like, the boss battles, because I spoiled myself on that, I'm going to be pretty much blind. Like, I want to try to find all the star coins and see how I do. And, uh, well, that was mandatory. Oh, I think we have a bullshit boss coming up. It's getting all close and personal on the gamepad. Oh lord. Okay, these are majority water and electric. Does this come down? Oh my god. Get him, get him, get him. Go, just go. Go to town on these friggin' things. We need more blues, come on. Oh my god, blue pigments out, what? Oh my god, we need fire, come on. Power me up, power me up. Ah, oh, dude, you dick. These things will die. Come on. I'm literally just like trying to do really good right now. <laughs> good lord. Oh my god, Dark Monita quit shitting everywhere. We're so tired of you pooping. Pooping out stupid poppy enemies like this literally looks like he needs to go to the bathroom. Oh my god. Just come to me. Everyone just come this way. That's right, go after my character, please. Now can you plop on your butt? Okay, whatever. You're cool. We're just gonna attack you. It's all good. He's dead. Okay, well now we're Hammer Pigmen. That's cool. The better to kill this thing with. Sweet! Okay. I keep wanting to talk about Earthbound and then I get distracted by this game and... Oh, okay, you are a biggin. Go, Pikmin. Thank God I wanted him gone. He looked really unnecessary. And my blue Pikmin buddy over here, my clone... My fellow comrade, you need to come down here and you need to get this whip seed. You get it. Oh my god. They're so huge! All of them! Like, can you lay off the roids? Okay. Thank god for hammer. Okay, let's go over here. Move me. We're obviously kicking ass here. God. It's like a huge boss battle of everything you faced. I'm expecting, like, Pinchipede and- oh my god. Why did it zoom out so much? Okay, come on. Bam, he's dead. Okay. Honestly, I can't even imagine the boss here. I'm expecting Pinchipede, honestly, but we'll see. I'm level 27, so I'm pretty sure I can take on Pinchipede, but uh make everyone yellow, supposedly. It is Pinchipede, of course. It's the one boss we haven't seen yet, I'm pretty sure. So, it's what? Monochromatic Pinchipede. Well, there's nothing special about it. It's the same thing, right? This shouldn't be that bad. Oh my god, you are really fast, though. That's probably the new thing. You're ridiculously fast. I'm just gonna punch the shit out of everything. I can only- well, okay, the black, they're black. And they're really fast, oh my god. Everything is too quick for me here. Like, look at this! Do they home in? Okay, they don't. But still, that's not good. Oh my god. He killed all of my Pikmin with one fell swoop. He ate them all. You prick. I need Pikmin to throw on you. They need to, yeah, stay on, stay on him, stay on him. We're in a circle right now. We gotta stay in the, well, there goes me. Come on, get his, get his mini parts. Rip him to shreds. Okay, they're all falling off. 
Come on, Pikmin! <laughs> this is ridiculous. He's the hardest one, seriously. The Pinchipede, I swear, he is the hardest one. Partially. Okay, come on. Get, it. get that last piece. He just has one piece. Come on, get him. There we go. Okay, now here comes the fun part. Not at all. It's not fun at all, but still. Okay. Dude, we didn't even phase through that one part, and now he's black. And we're dead. Look at all that nectar that fell. It's so sad. Oh, my pigment picked some of them up. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are awesome. Okay. Okay. Come on, get him, get him, get him. God. Just run away. Leap, leap. <laughs> This is crazy. Okay. It's pretty much rinse and repeat. So, um, I have seen the beginning portions of... Oh. My. God. You have got to be kidding me. And we don't have a big ol' heart? We're screwed. My one Pikmin helped me here. Fucking Jesus. Oh my lord. There's no way I'm gonna win this. Yeah, I, w I knew I was screwed. <laughs> that is crazy. Okay, there is a difference between hard and like, holy shit, what was that? And that was a holy shit, what was that? Let's look at the time we're at. This has been an unsuccessful video of Pikmin, <laughs> pretty much. Oh god, I don't want to do that, but uh Let's keep playing, and uh, I'm gonna fast forward to where I have to face this stupid poop hole. I'm not gonna, he's a stupid piece of shit. Let's just be blunt here. Okay, I came a little prepared this time, but since I knew it was Pinchipede, um, typically I think I do better with the whip power-up, so hopefully this time it'll be better. Um, and yeah. But anyways, I know I've been talking about this a lot, but Earthbound, there was that, and then actually it was gonna be a choice between, oh my god, um, Earthbound or New Super Luigi U. Which, obviously, Earthbound won, but, um, still. I was thinking about New Super Luigi U. I'm probably gonna get it in the future, I mean, I've always liked New Super Mario Bros. games. I've played the Wii one, obviously. I had the DS one, um, and they were nice. They really were, so, um, obviously, probably gonna end up getting New Super Luigi U. So yes, I'm gonna go for the smaller ones first, so those big ones won't be in the way and be a complete bitch, even though like three of them are out now. But um, the smaller ones are much more harder to break for some odd reason that I literally just don't know. Okay, screw you dude, you got your little black shits after me. You were a bitch, I did not like fighting you earlier, this fine midnight, whatever. It's not even midnight, it's like after. <laughs> the after hours, pretty much. Okay, here we go. Now this is gonna happen, and then we have to go ape shit. Even I get to contribute, yay. Dear lord, I do not like Pinchipede. He's so tough, it's ridiculous. Okay, I'm stealing your nectar, I'm sorry. I have to be a greedy piece of shit like that, but um, hey, this nectar is valuable. Okay, now here comes the fun part. Literally trying to survive. 
Okay, all my Pikmin missed, of course. I jumped in that. What's wrong with me? I can do this. Okay, I got Pikmin on there. That's good. Aw, oh, man. I stood there like a dumbass. Okay. He's pushing me around. This prick is literally pushing me around. Get on there. Yeah, there you go, Blue Pikmin. You get it. You get it. Okay. Let's just run over here. He's gonna dive down here. He pushes them into me! Pisses me off! Okay. Apparently I'm gonna get all this. Oh! This nectar is like bouncing everything around. I really hope that Blue Pikmin gets it done, because he can stay on there. Oh my god, yes! I freaking love my sister right now, and she was, she was an AI. <laughs> that's, that's... Well, you know what I'm getting at here. It's all Technicolor on the sides. Let's just get the hell out of here. It's been a rough night. That's right, you better land, you friggin' ship. But, um, there was a deal on a Club Nintendo about pre-ordering New Super Luigi U before August 1st and getting the, um, code inactivated, and you would have the opportunity to double your coins for Club Nintendo, as well as, um you get a chance to win a Luigi pin, and uh, it's not like a pin that you write with, it's like a legit Luigi pin, I guess you can like stick on your shirt or something, I don't know. But uh, it looked cool and I wanted it, so <laughs> that's all that matters. Um, but the thing is though that just caught my eye about it mostly was of course Luigi pin, and just the fact that I could double my coins. You guys don't know this, but um, I was a gold member, I don't know if I talked about this yet. <clears throat> but I was a gold member in um, Club Nintendo this year, and I was pissed because those posters looked so bitching. Like, there was a year Luigi one, a, um, one for Zelda HD Wind Waker, which was nice, and then there was Pikmin 3, and, um, I typically get posters, even though I only have one hung up on my wall now, which I hung it up, uh, today, which is awesome. I forgot to mention that. But still, it pissed me off so much that I was a gold member, and I ended up getting a calendar. <laughs> which is, uh, no. I'm gonna keep the calendar afterwards, of course, but still, it's just like, uh could have had the posters, man. I could have had the posters. And I got last year's, too. It was like Luigi's Mansion, Dark Moon, Kid Icarus, and something else. I don't know what the something else is, but I'm pretty sure it was good. I don't know which. I don't know what, though. But uh, I'm betting money that literally the next next poster for next year is going to do something with Smash Bros. And uh, I'm not missing that opportunity, so I'm going ham with Club Nintendo. I'm going to become a Platinum member. You just wait. It's going to happen. I will be a Platinum member. <laughs> you friggin' wait. Which, I wonder if you can register Earthbound. If any of you know that, please let me know, because um, you're still hopping on that instantly. Which, I will be playing Earthbound tomorrow, as well as watching the Walking Dead series which um, is going to be a problem because I need the gamepad and Wii for both of those because season 1 and 2 is on Netflix and i got to go out and somehow magically find a way to get season 3, I guess. Maybe find a friend who has it all recorded or something. Uh, let's be real here, that probably won't happen. But um, I'll find some way because everyone's talking about it and I just get into series that everyone talks about. It's ridiculous. But um, I wanted to get into Walking Dead because I've always seen people talk about it on like what was cool at the time, Facebook. And uh, I couldn't have it because I wasn't DirecTV. I was the Dish Network around here. So um, I couldn't have it. So unfortunately, I couldn't watch it. But um, now that it's on dish, yay, because I get to watch it, and this better not hit a friggin' skeleton or I'll be pissed. Okay, good. <sighs> I was still complaining about it even though I was safe. It means I didn't want it, period. I'm just about to, like, plop a bunch of coins and shit on here and just, like, go to town. Go, my pr go, my pretties. That's right. That is right. And I've been um, trying to master a lot of the games off-screen, too. Like, I mastered... Um, I'm almost... I'm trying to get that final stamp on... Okay, this pisses me off. If any of you know, like, how to get the final stamp on, um... Friggin' Captain Falcon's Twister Race, please tell me. Like, you have to do something involving, like, the perfect run, where you literally don't have to- you have to not hit anything. And, uh, I don't know why, but I have the biggest trouble with this mission. And, uh, I just can't do it. I don't know how, like, I don't know why I'm having so much trouble on it, but I just am. Like, I don't get it. Okay, finally. Um, and literally, I'm racing perfect. I'm pretty sure I'm not hitting any walls, and you have to do it in the first 12 areas. That's what it says on IGN. I looked it up. I'm probably gonna have to check another website, though, to, like, cross-reference. But, um, I'm doing a pretty friggin' good job. I think I'm doing some racing perfection here when I do it. Like, if you saw me. I was in the zone, auto zone, and um, I just don't, like, it just irks me that I'm having so much trouble with it, I guess. Because um, I need to do that, and I still need to take on Takamaru's Ninja Castle and finish that, which is going to be such a pain in the ass, because Takamaru's Ninja Castle is, it's good, but I'm not as good as, like, whatever the mission is. I haven't even checked out the mission, but it just looked like, when I probably read it, if I recall, I think I literally reacted in a way of, I'm so not in the mood for this right now. <laughs> and I wasn't. So, um, yeah, let's, can we go in that blue one over there? Yeah, oh man, you gotta be kidding me. Oh yes, that was perfect. Um, I'm being a little generous this episode and getting some more in. Other than five, because I need to get more done for um presents. 
So I'm just going to town, I guess. Trying to bring home the bacon, put bread on the table, as you would say. Oh my god, can we please? Come on. Thank you, but um, someone needs to go in here. Thank you. That's awesome. I'm gonna go for like eight. So one more and then we'll check out the presents. Oh man, this is actually easy. I might go for actually maybe nine or ten. I should go for ten. So uh, maybe I'll go for ten. Sounds nice. That sucks though that we only got one mission done in this episode, but it was so hard. Like, it was ridiculous. They threw in bladed beebs like it was hot chocolate on a cold winter night. Like, are you kidding me? And they were all the freaking colors of the wind? Like, no. You don't, you don't throw that shit on me right now. Especially at 3 fucking a.m. Like, that. no. Why? That's pure torture. Pure torture and torment. Uh, come on. Get in the bottles. Oh, by the way, um, I'm pretty sure a lot of you already know this, but Comic-Con was out, and uh, there was this video by IGN on YouTube talking about, or not really talking about, but it showed pretty much the introduction of Wonderful 101, and I'm so pumped for Wonderful 101. Like, I was pumped ever since, like, the first trailer for, like, just showing off the game a little bit. I was pumped there because I really liked the looks of it, and it looked promising, and it's obviously proving to be promising. Honestly, in my opinion, I think it will be a very, very good game. Because, I don't know, games that just look like that to me, they just they just end up being really good. I don't know why, but they just do. So, I'm really excited for that. Looking forward to it. Man, this is ridic. Come on. Gimme give, give me a little give me a little leverage here, game. I am just wanting that blue hole. That is right. And with that, let us check the ten presents that are scattered across the plaza. Ha, huh, you thought I'd fart this time, didn't you? That was a burp. Okay, there's one in the jukebox. Let's go ahead and knock that out of the way. While we search for the others. Is there just one? Yes, there is. This is the last one. I if I Yes, it is. This is the last one. We have completed the jukebox today, folks. So let's see what this Pikmin one is. This is the underground theme. That's going to be nice, trying to look for something. It sounds like we're on like a mystery case here. Okay. Nectar. Nectar. Nectar is a condensed, highly nutritional food source that has been scientifically proven to encourage a Pikmin's growth. Hmm. Also, it looks delicious. That doesn't look delicious. It looks like orange juice slobber. Telescoping, Telescoping pump, hog. pump hog. This creature compresses air in its bellows-shaped body and uses the pressure to shoot water or projectiles. I would, I called them huffy puffers in my younger days. Oh, the quirks of a single core processor. Nice, Monita. Okay, here's one. Oh God, they're everywhere, and I can actually see them. Jump switch. Gather everyone together on the switch and you'll be catapulted throughout the air, or through the air. Finally, an attraction where you don't have to wait in line. I'd say, oh lord. So that's one, oh my god, one, two, three, four. Here's five. Angular, Angular sapling. The fir trees is classified as an evergreen, long a symbol of vitality and eternal life. This one seems to be covered in snow, though, so much for the evergreen, haha. -ha. Monita showing emotion. Is that in her processors, quote-unquote? Oh boy. Egg. Oddly enough, these eggs follow the Yoshi card on their own. It's so tiny. No coercion. I don't know how to pronounce that required. This is good because I'm not sure how one would go about trying to reason with an egg. It's so tiny. Insert, like, adorable cuteness pun here. I don't know. Oh boy, this thing. Bilious bulborb. Bilious bulborb. The different sized spots suggest that these may not be a true subspecies of a bulborb after all. Or perhaps they're just normal bulborbs feeling a little under the weather. So are these like the depressed versions, I guess? Well, that kind of sucks. I believe these are like the last ones. I, I can't keep count worth a shit, guys. I'm so sorry. Um, why is... Oh, I thought this was like a f crow's foot. Like, I was like, why is this here? Banana. Bananas. Here's a tongue twister for you. Banana, 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 banana. <laughs> what? <laughs> Devious, isn't it? What the hell? I want to read that again. You guys do this. Banana, 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 banana. That is not a tongue twister. That's just ridiculous usage of the word banana. That is awesome. I'm so glad I didn't read these. Dear lord. Okay. Pear. Pair. Pair a pair of pears to get a pair of paired pears. <laughs> My search function tells me that this is a good recipe for fruit salad. Now that was a tongue twister. Not banana, 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 banana. Good lord. 
Okay, I know you want to wave, but we gotta get this over with. The hammer power up. Hammer seed. hammer seed. This item sprouts a hammer from a pigman's head. It doesn't look particularly heavy, but take one swing at the enemy, and you'll see that it gets the job done. Hmm. No comment for that, actually. I don't really know of anything, like, quirky or stupid to say. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's all of them. Yeah. Yeah, we're done. I'm pretty sure unless there's like one over here, which there doesn't seem to be. This this area is kind of packed now, like it's all getting packed, but let's see how many more we have to go. Oh my god, we only need two more. What? Only two more, guys. Oh my god. Looks like we'll only be... Well, that sucks. We have so many coins, too. But, uh, two more and then that's it. Damn, that's crazy to think about. We are literally getting so done, except that this episode literally only got us through one mission because that was just ridiculous bullcrap. And uh, my gamepad's about to die, so I think it's a good time to end the video right now. So yeah, thanks to you all for watching this episode of Nintendo Land. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and in the next one, of course, we'll be heading back to Metroid Blast and uh, taking some missions in there out of the way. Hopefully missions, not mission. And then, of course, back to Pikmin. And then, you know, you know the rest of the grind. We're almost done. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and see you then.